The high school league is moving forward with plans to hold state tournaments for winter sports right now. And while there's still plenty of uncertainty in the weeks ahead, the league is hoping these high school kids will get to play. Here's Fox 9's Courtney Godfrey. Here at Bloomington Kennedy High School, the dance team is hoping for their shot at state, something that, as of 24 hours ago, they weren't even sure was going to happen. We always took it day by day, and our goal this year was to compete one time. If we, if we were able to get on a dance floor one time, then we had a successful season. While this wasn't the season they had hoped for, the Kennedy High School dance team finally has something to look forward to. I didn't even know that we were going to have a season this year, and... You know, just to like be here with everybody, it's just like amazing. The Minnesota State High School League approving plans for state tournaments Thursday. A big win for student athletes after fall sports had playoffs cut short and spring sports never even took off. If we're going to err, we're going to err on the side of being too careful rather than not careful enough. The tournaments will look different from years past. Several sports will see a change of venue, and there will be a reduction in the amount of teams and individuals allowed to compete. In addition, there will be a limit of 150 spectators, and some sports, like swimming, will have none at all. We've been careful you know, all season with that, and this will just be an extension of that. For Coach Susie Maxey, none of this is new. We have guidelines here and check-ins here, and we have hand sanitizers and hand wipes and everything, and we're trying to keep the girls at at least a decent distance apart from each other. And all of it is worth it in order to try their chance at state. It brings back a little bit of normalcy to a season that has been anything but normal. In Bloomington, Courtney Godfrey, Fox 9.